Yeah, I graduated from Ohio State with a degree in drawing and painting. Um, and I got away from painting for a long time. I was doing mostly sculptural work and mixed media, but this is the, probably the most recent series I've done. It's, I need it's sort of painting and it's watercolor, which is something These I, animals. I, I had uh, very little experience with when I was in school, so I've kind of, kind of self-taught. Um, so that's a series of, actually those are all extinct birds out of Audubon's Birds of America. Uh, these are some planters that I designed. Uh, they are stainless steel and blown glass, and the glass is actually blown into them. Um, and this is a series of waxes I've been working on. So I, I kind of dabble in really all media, I suppose. But this is for glass castings that I'm working on. Um, this is actually a glass casting of a horse I did a while back. And I also do some digital work. So I have my computer here so I can edit my photographs or I can manipulate things that I need to. Are you usually working from home or do you have a studio that you've kind of had to transport to your house? I, both. I have a studio that is located downtown uh, on Jackson and 13th, uh, which is currently under construction. So only part of it is actually active. I can, I can actually use and make. I have uh, a little lamp working studio for doing oral silica glass work that I used down there. But everything else has pretty much been transferred to the house. Um, so yeah, I bounce back and forth. You obviously have a lot of parts of your house that you love, maybe from your friends and family that stop by. What is the thing that they love most about your house? What is something that maybe you guys are known for that people really like? I guess it'd be food and our presentations. Uh, yeah, just like how we decorate. A lot of people have commented on um, just our style and how we put things together. Um, I used to work for anthropology, mm -hmm. so um, a lot of that design aesthetic I kind of learned there. Yeah, and we, when also when we have people over, we usually have a pretty lavish spread of food that's presented on all of our estate sale finds and <laughs> different types of plates and platters and things like that. So that, that's usually what they comment on because, you know, everyone yeah. is more intrigued by food than most other things. So. What's your go-to snack for parties and get-togethers? Paella. I usually make paella. Yeah. You make it yourself? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. I went to Spain a couple years back, and ever since I've been hooked on tapas and paella. So that's typically my go to. <laughs> yeah.